Hey folks, it's Morgana Hilra here. So originally I was just going to do a photo post, right? But I know that I haven't done a video since my last update. So I figured I would show off this head. However, I'm just going to show the animation head because I have done so many of these um, like tutorials and stuff on the actual HUD that I just figured psh, I'll just bypass that for now. All right, so I'm wearing the Arukua, Aruka, oh, whatever, Aruka head. I believe it's called Nami, but don't quote me on that, okay? Um, I will have all the information on my blog. All right, so we have the blinky eyes. That's what it's doing right now. <laughs> um, I don't see, I haven't seen a, um, like, close eyes option. So, yeah, there's that. Um, lips option. I believe it's supposed to open, but it's not doing it. I don't know why. Ah, oh, there we go. There's one. Ooh. And then that one. Is it going to do anything? It doesn't want to do anything. It's camera shy. Okay, so that's the HUD. Yay! <laughs> um, I would remove it, but I'm hiding my... <clears throat> interface because I have a bunch of chats going on up in this corner and I just don't want them to pop up in the video. <laughs> it gets annoying. Alright, so really quickly, um, okay, I'll show you this HUD here. This is the Nana Skin and Makeup Applier Tone 3 from Your Skin, Your Shape. Alright, so uh, you can't see the eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can a little bit, like right in that area, but I'm wearing hair from Foxy, and I love Foxy, so I figured that I would just, you know, go with it. Anyway, so we're going to change the, um, the skin to show you the freckles. Is it going to show them? Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, you can see it right here on the, the side of the face. <laughs> See, it changed. You got that one to this one. Now, the one thing to know about this HUD is that the um, freckles and makeup layers and everything are skin specific. So if you get another, ha uh, another tone from um, your skin, your shape, you've got to make sure that you're wearing the proper um, freckles and stuff for that skin tone. Trust me, they're not interchangeable. I tried that. It doesn't work. <laughs> All right, and then there's this one. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to... Up, yep, there it is. See, it's on the side of the face over here. And that pet, eh? I like freckles. I don't know why. Like, not freckles per se, but moles and stuff like that. And then you can have this remove button. I love the fact that your skin, your shape has a remove button. Um, a lot of appliers do not have that. And it is effing annoying. Like, seriously, oh my god. Sometimes you just want to, like, I don't know. Here, I'm going to remove the eyelashes. Um, sometimes you want to, like, change up the makeup a bit, and there's no remove. And it's like, oh my god, why? <laughs> All right, so here's eyelashes. One. Actually, you know what? Let's remove that and remove the makeup altogether, okay? So that way you get an idea of what it looks like. All right, so I'm wearing my um, Izzy eyes, of course, and this is not the bento sh the bento head. I'm not wearing a bento head because I didn't want to change my shape just yet. I wanted to wait until I actually had, um, you know, stuff on that I, I, uh, I wanted to wait until I was able to release the shape. So I'm gonna put eyelashes back on. <clears throat> That's the simple eyelashes. See, my voice is going. <clears throat> Ow, sorry, I know you guys hate that, but unfortunately, you know, I had to. And that's the more dramatic look. I always go for more natural. Here's your first makeup. I don't know why my eye keeps coming through like that. Hold on, let's pop this sucker and grab it. <laughs> Watch me have grab the eyelashes or something, because it's taking forever. Oh my god, I think I grabbed the head. So, how was your day? My day so far has been interesting. Come on. Oh my god, it's not going to respond. Oh, 
Oh, look at that. It's me. So why is she blinking like that? Oh, God. It's like a blonde moment, you know, like derp. Okay, I'm going to try and grab the eyeball. Maybe. See, I don't know why it takes so long to just freaking grab the mesh, you know? Uh, screw it. Doesn't like me. I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's go inside the head, shall we? Hello. Hello, cheat. Okay, so there's where the eyeball should be. I believe that's it right there. Hello. Why are you doing this to me? It doesn't like me. It's not going to let me select it, so... Um, I guess we'll just have to bear with it. Okay, so there's the first makeup. Here, let's get this and stop the blinky eye. How's that? Woohoo! <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice that makeup. That's cool. I like that. I'd probably put that back on after. <laughs> I guess that's like, it's the same one, but just softer. I wish there were more colors in the eyeshadows. I guess you have to buy a separate HUD for that. Um, I would have loved to have been able to match it with my shirt, as you can see. And I will show you that in just a moment. Okay, and here's another one. That's more like a dramatic eye. I'm going to go with this one because it's kind of cool. And then, of course, you got your lipsticks. And again, these are skin specific. Specific. Blah, 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 blah. You have to be wearing the right skin in order for them to look proper. Like you can't wear this, like this makeup HUD, and then like put tone four on or five on, because you know then it would just look really weird. It would look like it was painted on. And you know, I know they call makeup war paint, but I think that's taking it just a little too far. Okay, so um. Here, I'm going to prove my point here. All right, interface coming in. See, right there, chat. Okay, I'm going to take this off, maybe. I'm going to take this off. Yay. Oh, that's why I couldn't grab the eyeball. Da, 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 da. Because <laughs> I didn't have my interface showing. Oh, man. It's just been one of those, you know, days where my brain just kind of farts and says, yeah, forget it. I ain't working for you. Do, 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 do. All right, so my jewelry. I'm not even sure where this nose ring is from, but I will have that detail in my blog post. It's an old one that I've had forever, but I wanted it for this post. I know it's not sitting properly, but I'm an elf, so yeah. And this necklace here is from Mandala, and I believe it's actually, it might be a new one. I'm not even 100% sure on that. See how wonderful I am? I'm so smart. <laughs> My bracelet is from, is it Kisbet? I'm not even sure. <laughs> There's the ring that goes with the Mandala, and I should have, like, placed it better, but see my ring? My nail polish is from dark passions and it's for uh genre um i didn't even know that um event was still around so yeah shows what i know now this line here um that is just part of the um omega uh there's really nothing you can do about that unless you have like a high 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 end computer Oop, that's part of the pose okay there's my watch. This is also from Mandala. I really like the interface. That looks so cool. And if you actually look at it this way, you can't tell, but you can set the, um, the time to your country. So right now it is, I set it to New York, which is Eastern Standard Time. So, yep, yay me. You know what? I didn't even notice that flaw. <laughs> That's with the body, though. We're good. Now, this right here, I can't get it to fit personally, but, I mean, certain poses will s mess it up, right? So, normally, this right here would be covered if you wear um, slink. 
The Maitreya one didn't look right either, um, and she doesn't have a Belize one. So I figured for this, I would just show the front, but obviously I just showed the back. But I figured that um, I would wear it anyway, because like I said, I was only going to originally do um, a photo, right? And, you know, proper angles and stuff, like right there, you can't really tell that there's an issue there, right? Um, of course, I would make a note of that, but since I've done the video, I don't have to, because now you already know. And these boots are from Adams. They're called Dr. Adams, actually. <laughs> I love them. There's, like, different things that you can do with the HUD and everything, so, of course. There's always something you can do with the HUD. Now, this outfit, the sweater, the shorts, and the tights are from Snatch, and it's a new release. And if it's at an event, which I don't know, but if it is, it will be in the description, of course. You just have to make sure that you read the entire description because um, I always put, how it goes is I'll put the article, like the article, like the article of clothing, like um, top or outfit, the store name, the outfit name, the creator's name, and then if it's a new release, I'll put new release, or if it's an event, I'll put the name of the event, the month of the event, and that's pretty much it. Now, I am beginning to think that I'm going to cut doing the um, creator's name because sometimes it's really um, stressful to have to hunt down their names because believe me, sometimes, like, okay, with my, um, not my eyes because Izzy does it right, but um, with eye places like song, um, what'll happen is you right click on the, uh, the mesh and you assume that you can find the creator, but no, it goes to somebody named Faust or something like that. So I might actually stop doing the creator's name. Let me know if you actually even pay attention to the creator's name or if it's just the store name that you're concerned with. Um, so let me know in the comments below on YouTube or on my blog post. Um, I think that's it for now. I am going to show a little tutorial later in the week on how to get rid of that nasty glow that people are complaining about on the Isis body. Um, hopefully that'll be good. See, I told him it was our breaks. Jesus, sorry, I just heard our car out there, and Jeff's driving it, and he was backing into our spot, and um, I heard the brakes groan, so he's trying to tell me that it's not our car, it is our car, our car sounds like sh bad, okay, it sounds like, um, I don't know, it sounds like a twisting metal kind of sound, but it's coming from the brakes, figure that one out. All right, so I'm going to head out because it's almost dinner time here and we're having turkey soup or stew or something weird. And I'm going to also play some wow and stuff like that and listen to my dog whine her face off. Shiva, come. Up, let's go. Thank you. Oh, God. Are you okay, Shiva? I see your face. I'm so happy. <laughs> Our dog had a haircut on her face. Yay. Anyway, I'm going to go because I could just, like, so totally just sit here and gab like all night. Uh, thanks for everyone who's been supporting me for this past week, by the way. You guys have been great. You got me through a really big hump there. And so I'm very thankful. All right. Talk to you guys later. Please subscribe. Bye.